Hello. We've seen a bit of a respite in the weather after the recent rain that many of us have seen. High pressure has been building over the past day or so. And into the weekend, lots of dry, cloudy weather, quite mild and breezy. Some rain in the forecast, but it'll mainly be across the northwest of the UK. And for Saturday, we're seeing that rain as the weather front moves in across the Western Isles, parts of Highland, some rain up towards the Northern Isles too. Could be the odd spot for Northern Ireland, the Cumbrian Fells as well. But drier weather elsewhere, some brightness breaking through, but generally it is going to be another cloudy day. But it's milder than recent days, so double figures across the map, somewhere between about 10 to 13 degrees on Saturday. But let's take a look at the expected rainfall that's going to accumulate just through the weekend. You can see these colours, these deep greens and white colours across the west of Scotland. We've got an amber warning for heavy rain across parts of Highland. Could be about 175 millimetres there. So enough to cause some flooding that's through Saturday night and through Sunday as well. So wet weather continuing to pile in across the west of Scotland as we head through into Sunday morning. Drier elsewhere and again a frost free night with temperatures remaining between around 8 to 11 degrees. So we've got the mild air with us on Sunday. It's coming in from a southwesterly direction. It's lasting through the day on Monday and for some of us into Tuesday as well. But colder air just waiting to the far north there. And where those two air masses meet, that's where we're seeing the rain. So for Sunday, the rain persistent across the northwest of Scotland. At times it's going to move in for Northern Ireland, northwest England as well. Clearing away, I think, later on from the far north of Scotland. But temperatures certainly on the mild side, 13, 14 degrees for many of us, a touch cooler in the far south, and also the northern Isles. We're in the cooler air to the north of that weather front. So this frontal system, as we head through into Monday, slips its way southwards and eastwards, tending to fizzle out, but it will bring a few showers. Another fairly breezy day, I think, on Monday for many of us. Quite a bit of cloud, the odd spot of rain around across central parts of England and Wales. Possibly staying dry for the southeast of England and eastern Scotland too should see some dry weather with a bit of sunshine breaking through. But in general, it's mild, breezy and cloudy once again. Temperatures certainly above average, really across the map between about 10 to 13 or 14 degrees. Just a little cooler across the Northern Isles. Moving through into Tuesday now and the next active weather front moves in from the Atlantic. That is going to bring quite a lot of wet weather, I think, for Tuesday across parts of southern and central England, Wales too, drifting gradually eastwards through the day. Really windy conditions through the English Channel. And then further showers move in on this northwesterly breeze developing across the northwest of the UK. Could even be a little bit of snow over the highest ground of Scotland. But for most of us, it'll be rain. But we're back into single figures across the northern half of the UK, holding on to the milder weather down towards the south. But into the middle of the week then, for a time, the milder air clears away. So something a little bit colder for a time through the middle of the week. But it looks like that Atlantic milder air will push in quite quickly again from the west. So what does that mean? A cold start to Wednesday, perhaps one or two wintry showers over the highest ground in the north. But by the end of the day, as that milder air sweeps back in, it's going to bring further rain towards the west. So still in double figures for the likes of Belfast, Plymouth as well. Aberdeen only around about seven degrees or so for Wednesday. Further ahead then for Thursday onwards, still a fairly unsettled spell of weather on the cards. Some shower or rain symbols on the outlook here. Perhaps just a chance of things turning a little bit wintry towards weekend, but I think any wintriness over the higher ground across the north. Bye for now.